Magmar versus Magmar versus Vanar. Uh, we're going second. All right, uh, this is a okay hand to start second with, depending on what the opponent plays. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm fine with this. Uh, let's confirm. Oh, that's a lot of Magmar wins. But anyways, let's see what the opponent plays, and then we'll go from there. A Kujata. So we can kill it. So yeah, we, we definitely have to kill it. So we'll just go forward, play a Prismatic Illusionist. Like, normally I don't want to spend two spells just for one minion, but I feel like we can benefit from that. So we'll just do a stun there to get an illusion, and then a mana death grip to get a mana and another illusion. And then we'll end our turn with a more better board position. All right, I guess this will be a friendly match. <laughs> oh, natural selection on the prismatic. Well, rip. I mean, that's fine. We we got another mana death grip. We got aspect of the fox and a heart sister. In theory, I might just replace the heart sister. Hopefully, I can get like uh, another arcanist. But let's replace this. Then we got a polarity. Well, I mean, that's something, but uh, we'll just attack the general, move this back, and then we'll end our turn. Alright, now we can do something. We can do Circulus, Bloodborne Spell, and all of this jazz. Alright, Sun Steel Defender, so we can Aspect of the Fox, Mana Death Grip, and then Circulus, and do a lot of things. And, ooh, card draw. I like card draw. And we got our Trinity Wing, I mean, which we could play, but uh, first things first is we have to Circulus uh, back here, so we have options. Uh, Aspect of the Fox, the Sun Steel Defender, and then Mana Death Grip, Attack. So we have two mana left, so we can do two illusions or we can do an illusion and a bloodborne spell. I feel like that's the better option, so uh, yeah, we already attacked so we can't move. I'll just play an illusion there into a warbird. So the opponent will be at 17, we're at 18, and then I'll just, uh, oh, I don't, I'll move this here in a way so it doesn't, I, like, either way it's in frenzy range, so we'll end our turn. Let me get another circulus. Alright, so yeah, not much we can do. We can do a Trinity Wing or after we play like an Illusion. Other than that, uh, bye bye Circulus. Uh, that's not good. Like, we, we need to get a board state quickly if he's gonna just uh, keep removing my things. Uh, natural, yeah, like Natural Selections for Ripperoni Circulus. We have another one we can play. Uh, but we need to do more things. So in this situation I'm gonna replace polarity or no I'm gonna replace an illusion because illusions are a dime a dozen. Look at it, I'll be sage. Ooh, I like that. But uh, we don't have any mana, so I'm gonna save the I'll be sage for later. Um, so we're just gonna do I'm gonna bait him with another circulus, maybe. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna do another circulus into a trinity wing. Then we have one mana left, so we can just do an illusion just for that extra card draw. Just move this over here, move this over here, and play an illusion there. And then attack for two, we'll end card. Actually, we'll just, uh, yeah, we'll end our turn. Here we got Aspect of the Fox, so we have a lot of spells to buff things up. I don't know if he has like a War Beast, because I position myself horribly if he had a War Beast. Yeah. And he, he has a free card draw, but. Uh, because I have a full hand. Alright, uh, let's see what the opponent's gonna do.
he's running away, but that doesn't tell me if he has a war beast or not. If he plays one, then I'll believe it. So, uh, yeah, like I said, I played right into that. That's totally fine, though. We can bounce back. We can definitely bounce back. Because we have an Albi Sage, so hopefully we can do lethal. We'll just play an Albi Sage back here. And then we have a lot of mana for a lot of spells, so we'll just do 2 damage. Actually, let's count. So I'll uh, get plus 2, so that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So we have enough for lethal, so we can just do 2 damage to the general. Uh, restore health to us. And then we can do. I mean, we can also attack with our general too, but uh, I mean, we we'll might as well do that, right? So we'll just do that into a warbird. So then we have one mana left, but the polarity costs nothing. So then we can aspect of the fox this thing. And then we can fly this over here. And then we can do a polarity here. To do 16 damage, which is a lot of damage, and my hand is full of illusion. So that was a that was a very very decisive game. Um, that was really interesting. So yeah, that that was something. I'll tip him.